Our 75 year old rider is gonna ride e-bikes and choose his favorite. Stick around. Hey everyone, I'm Dustin. I have nearly 20 years experience in the bike and e-bike industry. And today I'm joined with Bobby. He's 75, he's six foot one. He's only ridden e-bikes once before for about a hundred yards or so. Just before this, we actually got him on e-trike. So he has a little experience, but he's not really ridden two wheel electric bikes. So he's gonna test out all five of these models, give his feedback and tell us ultimately which one he likes best. Now, before we get into it, hit that subscribe button below, stay in touch with us here at 630, be the first to know about all the new content we're putting out, giveaways we're doing, and of course, new product releases. Also, all five of these e-bikes are linked in the description below if you wanna find out more information. All right, Bobby, thanks for coming out today to Thank test ride. Now, you're a pretty avid bike rider, right? Um, yeah. yeah. You ride weekly, you said? About weekly, yeah. Um, and you're out doing a few miles every ride? Yeah, between, between five and 10 miles. Five and 10 miles. Okay. And have you ever had the urge to get an e-bike or not really? Well, not really, I haven't really thought about <laughs> okay. it. Okay. You know. Well, we'll see if we can convince you today. Um, so let's just walk through all of them. So starting out here on the right, this is called the simple step through because it has a very low step through height. Um, now he was on the e-trikes before, so I walked through a lot of things with him. Uh, here's your display on this one, your power button. And you've got your plus and minus, which are these top and bottom, and you have the same kind of throttle, which is right here. And um, now the difference on this one is the shifter is a twist. This is a twist shifter for the gears, not for the electrics. So you could, you know, you could twist it like that. You typically want to be riding when you twist it to shift the gears. Right. Um, so yeah, if you want to jump on, I'm going to get my chariot so I can ride with you. All, All right. right. Does, Does it feel, feel okay, okay the, the seat and everything? everything? The seat feels fine. Yeah. Okay. okay. Go. Yeah. yeah go, go for it. it. Okay. <laughs> you like, like the, the two, two wheels, wheels, huh? Yeah. Keep going. going. You're good. This is a blast. Yeah, yeah you, you like, like it? it? I like I love it. We'll go home. All, All right. right. So that was your longest ride ever on an e-bike. Yeah. And you loved it. I loved every second of it. <laughs> cool. That, nice. Yeah. So this is a 500 watt um, rear hub motor. This is the same. The difference is a little bit different frames. So this has the very low step through frame. 
This one has a low step through. The pedal, it's a little bit, actually, the pedals are a little more out in front of your body on this one. Okay. So it's gonna feel a little bit different, but not too much. Um, so go ahead and power this on. All right, now there's your display. Now, so you've got little different buttons here in terms of the plus minus. I can raise that seat. Does that feel kind of low? Uh, it's fine. It's okay. fine. All right. All right, whenever you're ready. So did you feel any difference between those two e-bikes? The handlebars are a little bit more, uh, you know, you have to really kind of get into it, lay into it. Okay. Any difference in the comfort, riding position? No. No. Do you have a preference out of the two of those? This one, the black one. Okay, all right. Okay. All right. Now, all in all, I think I'm beginning to feel a little bit more comfortable with the e-bike. Well, yeah. You know, how they behave, how they how they feel, how they ride. Yeah. At first, I was a little shaky. I wasn't sure, but now I feel like I'm a little bit more confident. Confident. Yeah. Good. Okay. All right. So here we've got like a traditional kind of looking beach cruiser e-bike. Now it's got a little higher top tube. Motor size is the same of, as those. Um, little different riding position. So it looks heavier and bulkier. Uh, about the same weight. These are this one's steel and these were aluminum, so a little bit different. Uh -huh. But yeah, do you want to jump on and try? Whenever you're ready. Okay.
All right, minus the rubbing noise, what did you think of the riding position? Actually, I liked it. Yeah, okay. It's a little, um, like I said, bulkier, but uh, uh, I think to compensate for that, I'm feeling a little bit more confident. Confident. Mm -hmm. And so it's not a big factor. Okay. Right? Did you feel you still stick with that first one, the simple step through as your favorite? I think, yeah, by a couple of points, yeah. And what about the higher t top tube like that? I don't think that makes a big difference. Doesn't bother you? No. There you go. No. Okay. They're all fun to ride. Cool. All right, now we're moving on to our more compact smaller so we'll see what you think so this one same power 500 watts it's a 20 inch wheel so gonna feel a little bit different on this one i recommend just start out in pedal pedaling uh -huh. and then as you get moving you can increase the assistance now you're back or you got the same throttle actually everything's the same so okay okay let me get the kickstand here okay go ahead Okay. I just wanted to move the pedals. Yeah. Okay. Ready when you are. Right. Lift off. All right, what is your thoughts? A little bit um, more finicky. Okay. You know what I mean by that? I don't know how to yeah, well, it's that. a lighter one, so I noticed on the pedal assist if it was kind of jumpy for you. Yeah. Uh-huh. Again, it's a matter of uh, getting used to each one. It, yeah. It's like each one of these bikes has its own personality. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. Um, okay, let's move on to our final one. Okay, so this is going to be the most powerful one. Okay. Uh, this is a 750 watt. So um, that's the biggest motor. So you're going to feel when you the you're going to feel it in the the get up. Nothing to be scared of. Just it's going to be more powerful. So now you're back to a twist throttle on this one as well. Okay. Okay. 
So your twist throttle's right here. Um, you're in zero. And yeah, now this one folds. So if you, folds. you know, folds in half oh. for transporting too. Won't affect you at all on the ride. You're not gonna produce a wheelie. Right? No, <laughs> no, no, it won't. Ready when you are. Okay, what'd you think? I can definitely feel that power. Yeah, felt more powerful. Oh yeah. oh yeah. All right, so what'd you what'd you think of the ride, the comfort? I liked it. Yeah. Yeah. The first one there, that's my favorite. Still your favorite. Still my favorite. And what do you what what about that one specifically? It just felt good. Uh, you know, I felt almost like I was kind of part of that bike. Okay. Yeah. And you felt safe felt, on that one? Yeah, I felt more integrated with it. Cool. Yeah, right. fair enough. But they're all, they all perform beautifully. I like them. I like them all. That's my favorite, though. Perfect. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, there we go. Bobby just test rode all five of these e-bikes. They're all linked in the description below. His favorite was the Simple Step Through 500 Watt. Uh, it's a great, easy to step on and off e-bike. So if you want to see that one again, it's linked in the description below. And if you have any other questions or comments, please put them below or reach out to us, the team at 630.com or call us 310-982-2877. We also offer a 30-day test ride your e-bike policy. If you don't love your e-bike in the first 30 days, send it back. No questions asked. No money out of your pocket. In addition to that, we warranty everything for one year. Anything goes wrong in the first year, we take care of it, parts and labor. And lastly, be a part of our community. We have a Facebook group called 630 Peddlers. There's thousands of members in there. Join the group before you purchase to talk to existing riders so you make the right choice. Then when you have yours, post in the group, make friends, and finally download our app to track your rides and compete on the leaderboard. So Bobby, thanks again for being Thank here. Thank you very much. And don't forget, it's your journey, your experience. Enjoy the ride.